Hi, we're here with Chris Nemi, owner of Paragon Automotive, to talk about one of the most common car problems that happens, that dreaded check engine light. Well, the amber check engine light or service engine soon light refers to the computerized engine controls. Uh, this could mean there's something wrong with the evaporative emission systems, the ignition system, or the fuel system. So this is generally a first time warning light to let you know that you are having some issues with one of those uh, systems. If you have some runnability issues and you're noticing the vehicle running uh, um, poorly, then you'll, you'll definitely want to check with the mechanic right away. So this is, a, uh, this is a scanner that checks the codes and it also does much more than that. It's also a lab scope and uh, helps us to, to diagnose the, the problems. Uh, you could have one code or you could have multiple codes. It really just depends on the situation. Most people will think that uh, you can plug the computer in and, and uh, immediately check, and, check and, and find out what the problem is. Uh, the code just gives you a reference of where to start. The, the, the scanner is a tool um, for us to use to find the problem. For example, what we're going to do is we're going to scan uh, for the codes. Um, we're going to check any uh, diagnostic material that applies to that code. Uh, we're going to use a scanner to check uh, the sensor output. Uh, hopefully that will, will send us in the right direction as to, to where your problem lies. Uh, we may have to smoke test the system to find leaks. Um, so once again, um, very expensive tool and, and is very helpful, but it just by looking at the code is not going to fix the problem. When, when we scan the computer, um, there may be one code, there may be multiple codes. Um, some codes may apply or may be related to each other, but you might have multiple problems. So um, you have to start with one code and isolate those problems and move on to the next. Um, this sometimes takes some time. A lot of uh, vehicles out there have um, had a check engine light on and off at times, some of them staying on all the time. There's not been any runnability problems and uh, most people are thinking that that's okay. Um, there is some, some codes that will pop up that are not as uh, severe as others. Uh, for the disadvantage of that, it would be that the light is going to be on all the time. So if you have another warning light or, one or another warning signal from another uh, com computerized engine control, uh, you're never going to know that, that's, um, that you're having a problem because the light is on all the time.